Serves you right, sucka. Doesn't feel to be on your knees, huh? <laughs> Worry not on wash masses. Our wondrous lives in Night City won't change much, but when do they ever? We live midst dust and chrome, and midst dust and chrome we shall all die. Now for some good news, and some bad news. This dam, remember it well, our beginnings. I did not know what to make of you then. You'll not get any tearful confessions out of me. Yeah, I wouldn't be tearful. I know you. What I think of you now matters not at all. Tomorrow we will be elsewhere. We'll start everything anew. You and I. Ask me then. Can't hardly wait. Get ready, Arizona. Here we come. <laughs> Look at the city. Somewhere in there, those bastards from Arasaka are wondering how they lost everything. They'll figure it out one day. But we'll be long gone. They'll never find us. I can promise you that. I know. Perhaps that's why I need a good long look. One day this view will be a happy memory. About to turn on your heel, never to see the city again. I think that makes you happy right now. And you? Ready? Do you feel the road beckoning? It's possibly your last glance at those buildings. Would you stay with me? If I change my mind? Didn't want to leave. They're my family, V. I can't abandon them. I wouldn't want to. And I'm glad I won't have to choose. You're coming with us. And then... We will see. Then? Maybe we ought to try not living for thens anymore. Shit, V. You're bleeding again. Figure this out, Pan Am. Vic's drug helps a bit now. And once we get to where we're going, we'll try all your contacts. They've pulled some of our folks out of deep, deep cesspits. They'll help. You'll see. Good to hear. It really is. Speaking of which, what about our plan? Everything is set and confirmed. We'll meet our people soon, gather our gear, and set off. Yes, the road could be hard. But as long as we don't fuck up, we should cross the border in a matter of hours. Let's get out of here. Sure. But V... Get a good look at the city. One last time. If you need to, I mean. I'll wait in the car. Good night, city. Good night and good luck. I've heard enough. Most of our people have already crossed. They'll wait for us on the other side. And our souvenirs from Makoshi? If we so much as approached the gates with tech like that, they would wipe us out without warning. We've checked. Arasaka has people at every border crossing. 
But we know a road less traveled. Arasaka. Deja vu. Did I say something wrong? Just reminded me of Jackie and the Arasaka job. Think you know how that ended. I'm sorry, V. Come on. You had nothing to do with that. And anyway, things will be different now. Gotta be. There is one thing I will miss about Night City. What's that? The food. The tie on 7th and Haywood. The pierogies down by the docks. Mm. Seriously? You'll understand once you've ridden with us for a while. Really? Then I can't wait. Of course our new lives will be nothing but pure fucking chaos. Of that I have no doubt. Doesn't matter. It's gonna be a good life. I can feel it. And you'll sense it too. from Night City or going to your granny's for cookies and milk. Got it or that storm will catch you. Screw you. Mitch, hey. Hey, V. Good to hear you, Chum. How's things? Give me a month and I'll be as good as new. I told you all I'd be fine, didn't I? Come on, Mitch. You weren't nearly that confident after Mikoshi. None of us were. He was in bed for weeks, a vegetable. It would have been the end of him if not for his synapses, toughened. Made almost fry-proof in Panzers back in the war. Did save every one of our asses, though. Teddy Saul's not with us. Or Teddy. Or Bobby. Or Scorpion. They would have kicked your ass out of whack after that move with the Panzer. Then hugged you until you puked. I know, Pan Am, I know. Gave us all a chance at a new start. Let's not fuck it up. I'm glad you're with us, V. See you soon. I can smell the ozone, even through the air conditioning. It's that storm getting close. Okay, we've arrived. It's high time. You don't know. Hey, Mitch. Hey, let's get the fuck out of here, shall we? Hey, how are things? Is everything arranged? Everything's almost set. So you found it? Where we thought it would be? All plans laid and in place. They are indeed. Come see us when you're done. We'll talk about the who, what, and how. Need any help preparing? No. It's all packed and ready to go. We were waiting for you. That's all. All right. So the plan. One more time. We won't take any official crossing. I think you know that, right? So there's this old smuggling tunnel. Forgotten. We'll aim to use that. It's near the wall. Wait. Are we talking about one of those famous Aldecaldo tunnels? Mm-hmm. One of the oldest ones, this one, too. They dug through right after the first war. Aldecaldo stopped using it years ago. We got tipped off that Night Corp had found it and started monitoring the area. 
You scan it? You sure the tunnel's even open? Hasn't caved in anywhere? It's open along its entire course. And all it needs is to stay open for us this last time. Then it can collapse. We won't be needing it anymore. Look, tunnel's cool and all, but we gotta get there first. And what about security up and down the border? Whole area's brimming with tech. Drones on perpetual patrol? Heavier stuff too, maybe. Don't worry. We know what's there and what to do about it. And Carolyn Cassidy will keep the corpos off our tail. And nobody's likely to spot us. Sooner or later, the border guards will realize something's not right. But by the time they get around to it, we'll be far, far away. Plus, that storm's a true stroke of luck. It should cover our tracks. We'll need more than a storm to keep the corpos off our tail. Got bigger concerns than us. And even if they don't, just let them try and catch us. They'll regret it. Great. And once we've crossed, what then? We'll make for our meeting point, join the rest of our people there, then we'll move on towards Tucson. And once there, we call the shots, right? We know the road's like the back of our hand. And down in Arizona, we have some old favors to call in. <laughs> so even if I wanted to, I got nothing to worry about. Starting today, it's not all on your back. You're no longer alone, V. You'll get used to it. It's nice. Thanks. Well, time to move, before that storm finds us. We're ready. After you, Pan Am. Are we all set? Mm -hmm. So jack in. Let's get the hell out of here. You got it. This is your big new beginning. So you have to start it like a real nomad. Behind the proverbial wheel. Mostly go straight. Go around the bigger holes and don't lose the rest. Got it? I will deal with the nitro. The mix will go straight to the cylinders. If I don't sink it just right manually, it could blow us to bits. I think that's best avoided. Fuck. I just realized something. What? The portal. It wasn't here when I was there. I never imagined it would be. But I had this inkling that everything was different up north. That some bright fucking future awaited me there. Yeah, I think I know what comes next. Once you wound up on the other side and nothing changed, you thought Night City was the answer. Everything would change there. Yes. And you know the tale's end, too. I'm returning. Right back to where I started. Fuck. No. I'll be the same place on the other side, same space, but you're different. Totally different. All in all, you're right. And I have you. And the rest of these clowns. You ready? I'm ready always. Then hit it! Home stretch! Full speed ahead! Slow down, Pan Am. Not yet.
All great, Pan Am. We're going home.
I wanted to... Oh, voicemail. <laughs> Why not? V? I was wondering if you could pass a message along to Johnny. Two messages, actually. One, that he's an arrogant, egotistical son of a bitch. And second, that it was nice to talk to him again. Both of you, take care of yourselves, okay? See you. 